Lewis! How you doing? What's good, man? How are you? I am very well, thank you very much, Kel. That's quite... I'm very well, Kel. That's quite good. I quite enjoy that as a rhyme. I quite like that as a rhyme. How are you? I'm good. Here's something interesting you should know about my name. My full name, Kellen Walker, and it's actually Irish. Kellen Walker? Uh, wait, yes. what, do you know what part of that in Ireland? I don't know. Um, I would have to ask my mom. My mom would know, a, but she always reminds me a, of that. A great place in the world, Ireland. Do you like Guinness? Guinness is a little heavy. Um, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. You know what I mean? It's not yeah. good for, like, it's not good for, see, the next day. It's right. Like, it's, not, it's not a comfortable bathroom break. Isn't it in Scotland, the popular beer there, is it Tenements? Is that how you pronounce it? Tenements. Good stuff, Kale. Yes. Tenements, yes. Absolutely. It's, it's a delicious, it's a delicious, it's a golden delicious elixir, and it goes down smooth. It is a beautiful Really? Thing. It is a beautiful I've heard thing. about it. Yeah, I've heard about it. It's amazing, honestly. There's nothing better than coming home from, like, tour or whatever you've been, because there's not many places in the world that do it. Do you know what I mean? Right. It's very hard to get anywhere else. So, like, to come home back to Scotland and have a, have a pint and tennis is, is incredible. That's awesome. Now, I want to ask you, Lewis, uh, your, your voice is amazing. Um, and I, I saw that, that you, you really committed to singing at like 17, 18, 17 years old. Yeah. Um, were you always around music? Was music always in the house? Were your parents into music? You know, not like mass, not massively. Do you know what I mean? It's, it's a very yeah. like, they always, they loved music, but they didn't, they're not musicians and they're not, like, do you know what I mean? They're not any part of that. I mean, my dad will tell you that he, that he is, he was the the performer at a young age and stuff. But like, in actual fact, he did nothing. But um, <laughs> yeah, no. So I think it was always like we used to go on holiday to our vacation to mm. France, but we used to drive from Scotland, which we took fucking ages. It took so long, right. and it was like you would drive overnight down to England, get on a boat get the boat over to France, then drive a couple, like a day down in France. And they used to like play like music in the car on the way on those trips. And that's like my first memory of music is like listening to bands like Queen and people like, you know, people like, uh, like Queen and Genesis and all these kind of like really like classic rock kind of mm -hmm. bands, you know what I mean? And that was kind of like my first, yeah, I guess awakening into music and stuff. And uh, and yeah, so not 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 massive. My brother was in bands and stuff, but he was rubbish. No, I'm joking. He uh, he was like <laughs> he uh, so he he um, but no, yeah, so he was in bands and stuff, and maybe that was like something. But yeah, my parents never went like major into the music What what's the what was what's the music scene like in Glasgow? Because I've never really heard about it. Right of... now, I you're maybe I've, you're asking the wrong guy <laughs> because <laughs> I. You know, because I've become a big, a big star and I forgot my roots. No, I'm joking. Uh, but I think, no, I don't, like, you th honestly, I'm not really sure. When I was kind of first coming up, because I was playing gigs since I was 12. So that I'm 23 now. I didn't start, like, things didn't start happening until I was, like, 21 or 20 even. So it's, like, eight years of gigging. And it was good, man. Like, there's, there's tons of bands out there. There's tons of, like, like, amazing music being made. And it's so, like, different. And there's so much, like, you know, from, like, rock to like elect like kind of this electronic pop stuff to your straight up pop to rap to like there's so much like music getting made and it's it's an incredible it's, it's it is an incredible thing i'm not sure about like bands at the minute like i, I know there's like a brilliant scene but like i know there's like band well there's a lot of bands coming through now that are, that are pretty incredible so yeah it's always been good there's always been places to go play and stuff it's like as 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 i, I stay in between the two like i live mm -hmm. right in between glasgow and edinburgh so like the two kind of big cities in Scotland. And Edinburgh's music scene is kind of struggling a bit because there's, they're, they kind of keep closing down venues and stuff and it's getting harder and harder oh, to yeah. find gigs um, in Edinburgh. So yeah, so Glasgow's definitely the one. Now, that's where you go, I think, if you want to play. If you want to do you your know, thing. Shows, yeah. Now, now Lewis, uh, I've heard, because you're a very smart man, and I think this is genius, oh, wow. that you still live at home. <laughs> which I yes, think is, I do, yes. Which is smart, dude. You're saving money. Saving um, money, my mum washes my pants, everything's great. It's a beautiful thing. I'm here, I'm at my, this is, I'm at my parents right now. So it's like, yeah, uh, yeah it's been, I, it was a good idea before quarantine. Now during quarantine when you can't leave the house and they're yeah. there all the time, that has been an issue. I won't lie to you. I'm ready. Me and my mother have never been less 
pleased to see each other than we are every morning now. Do you know what I mean? But, uh, but yeah, no, it's, it's good, man. I quite enjoy it. Now, with that said, I mean, does that help you stay grounded? Mm, I would say so. I mean, I don't, I don't know if I have any real problems with it because I think there's something about being Scottish where you, you just kind of feel... I don't know. The, the Scottish people are very, like... They don't, I don't, I don't know how to explain I think it's maybe UK, like, when someone does well, instead of being like, come on, everyone's like, just watch. Like, everyone's immediately like, right. just be careful you don't become like, immediately people are like, as, 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 you play a gig to like 400 people or whatever, and people will be like, you be careful, we're watching you. <laughs> and if you just change even this, because people just like, they like, like in Scotland, like, the, like, especially my family, like taking the piss out of each other and kind of, you know, like, yeah, making fun of each other is like, that's how we show affection. Right. And I think it's like, yeah, they, they, my parents and my family and my friends and all that would let me know for sure if uh, I started to get ideas above my station. Do you know what I mean? 100%. You got, you got good people around you. No, that's good. That's good. Oh, they'd, they'd slaughter me. It would be like, I would be like torn to pieces in terms of like, they would make, I, I, I can't, the jokes that they would be flying away would be outrageous. Do you know what I mean? Now I, now I need to know this. Who makes the better shepherd's pie, mom or grandma? Oh, uh, well, my grandma's dead, so mom. No, I'm joking. So, I mean, my, grandma, my grandma is dead. She is dead. Uh, Jesus she, probably makes, she probably makes a terrible shepherd's pie. To be, let's be honest here. Like, I wouldn't, like, I wouldn't want to have one made by her because she's probably not in, like, the best position to make me a shepherd's pie. Right. Um, but, yeah, my mum my my probably. But even then, she's a terrible cook. So, in fact... I might take my chances with my grand. Do you know what I mean? I might take <laughs> with my grandmother at this point. Uh, no, yeah, I don't know. I, I guess I'd say my mum's. But yeah, it's a shepherd's pie, quite, it's a hard thing to get right, but when, it, when it's done right, it's, uh, it's a tremendous thing. So maybe I'll just, uh, I'll go to like a seance or something. You know those things where you like try and summon the dead? Like, and, yeah. the, and the summon the spirits? I'll do that and I'll ask my grandmother. You ask her, there you go. Something. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. So now, Lewis, I know since like 2020 has pretty much canceled itself. Um, yes. have, you been, have you been able, even from like home, been able to like get work done? Are you recording at home? Have you been yeah, writing? Yeah, man. 100%. Yeah. I've just, um, I've, uh, the second album, I've, I've managed to like get it started and get it underway a lot quicker than I was expecting. Like it's really, really coming together Good. well. I mean, it's like, I'm not, I'm not one of these people who's like, I'm going to change my sound and I'm going to like, think, I'm just going to do the same type of songs again because I just like feel like I quite I like doing it. I'm not really like I'm not going to do like a you know I'm not going to change things up massively. So it's been good, man. I just want to write better songs, and I think my music's very sad and very quite depressing. And there's nothing more depressing than 2020. So I've, I've got a lot of material. I've got a lot of material. Do you know what I mean? It is a it is a dark dark year. But um, but yeah no it's um, so yeah it's been it's been good so far man and like I got down to London like two weeks ago from a kind of quarantine starting to ease up a bit down here or over here sorry and uh, and I got down to London next week and was able to get in a proper studio and start doing stuff so so yeah hopefully a second album I won't release any music in twenty twenty I feel like people have suffered enough uh, already <laughs> next year and uh, I think I'll wait till next year. For twenty twenty one to like to ruin people's to ruin people's year then. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> now, now, Lewis, when you get out of quarantine or when you're able to come back over to the states, because it's an absolute yeah. show over here. Um, yeah, no, are there, <laughs> seriously, um, are there any, uh, any particular uh, like producers or artists that you have in mind that you want to work with on the new album? Oh, come for sure. I mean, that's the thing. I was supposed to do like a big kind of session out in LA. Um, like a big sorry a few months a month or two out in LA to like start writing and recording I think um, yeah people like Phineas I'd love to work with there's people like Ryan Tedder Greg Kirsten Katarpoon like just there's so many like amazing singer songwriters like uh, there's a uh, the people like Ali Tamposi Julia Michaels like I just love to work with like um, yeah just as many people out there as possible especially in America because that's the thing in the UK it's kind of like even over Zoom in the UK it's quite easy mm -hmm. to make work because of the you know, the time difference, but the time difference from here to LA is like eight hours. So it's quite a difficult thing to even make happen over Zoom. So, um, but yeah, so I think as, as soon as I can get out, as soon as, I mean, I'll, 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 I'll make sure America's 
and, and a bit of a better position before I come over, do you know what I mean? But like, I think, uh, yeah, as soon as I can get the opportunity to come over and, and do some work there, I'm definitely, definitely going to take it. Well, Lewis, I'm not going to hold you up anymore. Thanks for kicking it, man. Uh, love someone you loved. Love uh, before you go. Both are Thanks banger. We're both playing them on Moving 92.5. I'm, sc- I'm, I'm the music director, so I'm the one, you know, putting them in. And I just, dude, I love your voice, dude. I love Thanks, the songs. And, man, we're just waiting for some more when everything gets back normal, man. So I appreciate your time. Thank you, man. It, man. Nice one. Thank you very much for taking the time to talk to me. And, uh, and yeah, thanks for playing the tunes and thanks for the money. No, I'm joking. <laughs> 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 All right, see you, buddy. Thank you so much, man. Take it easy. You too. Thanks, thanks man.